After months of protests and a federal court hearing, same-sex couples are now being issued marriage licenses in Rowan County. Following a judge's ruling yesterday holding clerk Kim Davis in contempt of court for failing to issue the licenses, several people showed up this morning to protest that decision, including her husband. WKYT's Hillary Thornton is live outside the courthouse in Moorhead with reaction now, and that is our top story at noon. Hillary? Good afternoon. For more than two months now, now, no marriage licenses were issued in the office behind me. Today, that changed as Kim Davis sits in jail and five of her six deputy clerks are complying with the judge's order. Now, we went in with that first couple who went to get their marriage license, and we also spoke to Davis's husband, who was here supporting his wife. Now, their son, Nathan, is the lone deputy who is still not issuing marriage licenses. And he says that the other deputies are under what Davis calls bullying by the judge. Uh, against their will, yes. Against their will. Like I said, Bunny just bullied them. Will Nathan interfere? No, he won't interfere, but he won't sell them either. Davis says his wife is in good spirits and prepared to stay in jail, quote, however long it takes, end quote. Meanwhile, it is a new day for many outside of her office in Rowan County as the couple of more than nine years, James Yates and William Smith Jr., made their way through the crowd as the clerk stores opened at 8 o'clock this morning. Excitement. <laughs> It's real. Yeah. The two who live in Moorhead say they had been trying to get a marriage license okay. since July 6th, okay. Okay. getting Give turned down name. five times. Very, I mean, they were very clear, very polite about that they could not do this. Yeah. Today, the couple is seeing a different result. Thank you so much. Thank you. And the first couple. Yeah. That couple says they have not set a wedding date yet, but they say it will be very soon now that they have their marriage license. As for Joe Davis, he says he's only been able to speak to his wife, Kim, on the phone, but he will be allowed to visit her in jail on Sunday. For now, in Rowan County, Hillary Thornton, WKYT.